Our science database provides access to research for biology, engineering, chemistry, and other STEM fields. You can access the science database from the library homepage under Articles and Databases. And from there, you can either go to S for Science or look under Subject for Health and Science Databases. Once you get to the science database, you can go ahead and enter terms in the search box. I'm going to put in climate change and ocean warming. And we get about 42,000 results. We can narrow down our results by adding more search terms, limiting to full text, limiting by source type, and limiting by date. So I'm going to start by adding some more search terms. I'm going to add a specific kind of um, fish, let's say tuna. And then I'm just going to put climate change in quotes to search that exact phrase, climate change, ocean warming, and tuna. So that narrows us down to about 400 results. I'm also going to click on full text here to make sure everything we find has full text access. Um, I'm going to go ahead and click on um, peer reviewed. I could click here on scholarly journal or I can click on peer reviewed journal. Either will work to get you academic research articles. And then the last thing I'm going to do is limit by publication date by pulling this bar up and let's say I want research from the last five years on ocean warming and climate change. Now we're down to about 230 results, and if you want to see an article, you can just go ahead and click on the title. So I'm going to click on this one, Observed and Projected Impacts of Climate Change on Marine Fisheries, Aquaculture, Coastal Tourism, and Human Health. And this toolbar over on the side um, has places to download the PDF, to cite your article, to email it, and to print it. You can read the full text here. I'm going to go ahead and email my article. And from there, you can put in your email and name to send it to yourself. You can also send yourself a draft of the citation. So I'm going to send myself the APA citation. And if you have any questions about searching our science database or any other research questions, contact us at Ask a Librarian.